What's up guys, it's your boy to Zlight here bringing you episode number 35 of our Pokemon Renegade Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we helped out gym leaders Candice and Maylene to calm down Regigigas in the Snowpoint Temple. Yeah, I know, you're wondering, if you only played Platinum, you're like, what? You did that this early in the game? Yeah, it's pretty interesting that you know that's usually not in the regular game, so um, it was pretty fun to do. Like, it's a nice thing that they added an extra event up here in Snowpoint City, uh, but now, after clearing out the gym trainers last episode, it is time to phase Candice for our seventh gym badge of the Sinner region. So, before we do that, let's go ahead and do a quick team recap so you guys can see what the team is looking like. So, first up, we have Vibranium, our Registill level 56, holding the leftovers with Iron Head, Earthquake, Thunder Punch, and Superpower. Then we have Forehead, our Rampardos level 56, holding the Lucky Egg with Rock Slide, Earthquake, Head Smash, and Crunch. Next up is Lazy, our Togekiss, level 56, holding the Charcoal with Moonblast, Air Cutter, Heat Wave, Nasty Plot. Then we have a Jaws the Feraligator, level 57, holding the Mystic Water with Waterfall, Ice Punch, Crunch, and Dragon Dance. Then we have KFC the Blaziken, level 57, holding the Muscle Bin with Blaze Kick, Sky Uppercut, Earthquake, and Bulk Up. And finally, we have Slick the Steelix, level 58, holding the Soft Sand with Earthquake, Iron Head, Stone Edge, and Crunch. So, our team... So far, as far as type advantages go, it's pretty good against ice. Like, this is a steel type, super effective against ice. Rock type, super effective against ice. Steel type, super effective against ice. Fire and fighting type, super effective against ice. The only one weak is lazy, and Jaws can still do work with Dragon Dance, and it's a pretty diverse moveset. My only thing is, I don't know who I should lead with. I think I might just go with Vibranium, because it's the safe lead. And I know that Vibranium can put in work if it leads. So, I think that's what I'm going to go with. So, let's go ahead... And head right into the gym. We still gotta do the gym puzzle, because obviously we gotta do that every time we enter. Oh my god, the sprite glitches, bro. <laughs> we still gotta do that every time we enter, so um, I guess without further ado, we just gotta destroy the freaking snowballs. Um, I'm not really sure which way I should go to do this. Hold on, let's, let's, let's start like this. Let's hit one of these. Hold on. Okay, from here. I can, there we go. I can destroy this one. Then I can head on over here. And, no, bro, we're not there. Go up this way, land on this one, and destroy this one. Then go here. I can destroy this one, and now I only have to destroy those ones at the top, which I believe I did by accident last episode. So there we go. Boom. All right, and now we are pretty free to head back here, and we are at the gym leader. All right, here we go. It is time to take on Candace Four. The seventh gym badge. Thanks again for your help inside the temple, Cecil. So, you're ready to challenge Candace? Sure thing. I've been waiting for someone tough. But I should tell you, I'm tough because I know how to focus. Pokemon, fashion, romance, it's all about the focus. I'll show you just what I mean. Get ready to lose. Uh, please, I don't want to lose. Um, I would, I would prefer if you didn't make me lose. So, alright. Six Pokemon, what, what is your lead level? Obama Snow? Level 55. Okay. That's fine. My team is pretty much around that level. Okay. I'm kind of scared of the Focus Blast. But let's go for an Iron Head. Okay. We do have speed. Can we flinch? Okay. It does over half. Nice. Earthquake. Okay. That's going to do a lot, but we have good defense. So I think I can take it unless it crits. If it crits, I cannot take that. Okay, he does exactly half, so a crit would have knocked us out. Okay, uh, let's just go for another Iron Head. Alright, Obama Snow, I literally forgot how to speak for a second. Obama Snow is out. We level up, level 57. Alright, what is next? Mamoswine. Okay. See, this is the thing. This thing is super effective against all these dudes, but... We do have a Feraligator. So I'm going to go to him. And hopefully Mimuswine cannot body our Feraligator. I'm tempted to put up a Dragon Dance. I really am. Ooh, Intimidate. I forgot. Do I always forget that Jaws has Intimidate? Because, I mean, usually Feraligator doesn't get it, but... Okay. Actually, does it get it? No, no, it doesn't. It gets... Yeah, no, that's not its hidden ability either. It actually doesn't get it. Anyway. Do I want to go for Dragon Dance, or do I want to go straight for the Waterfall? The Dragon Dance is so tempting. Okay, let's play it safe. Go for the Waterfall. He goes for Earthquake, so straight up, stab Earthquake. He is minus one attack, 
So we should be able to take this fairly well unless he gets a critical hit. Do not critical hit me. Okay, he doesn't. We land a waterfall. Okay. It's kind of weird how Mammoth Spine is so quick. Oh, of course you have the freaking, what, Pasho Berry? Yep, I knew it. Okay. Does just under half. Um, okay, I know I take another Earthquake. And I should take him out with a Waterfall, but if he crits, I am going down. Okay, do not crit me. Oh, we outspeed this time. How come? Is it a speed tie? Okay, well, you don't have the berry weakened, so you should get taken out. Yes! Okay, Mammoth Spine is down. Okay. You love to see it. Gain that experience. What is next? Get buffed by the hill. Frost Loss. Okay. This thing's pretty scary. But, if I'm able to go in with Forehead and Head Smash, it is going down. I think at least. But we're not that quick. That's the only thing. I kind of want to go to KFC, but again, if it has Psychic or Extra Sensory, KFC is not going to like that. This is actually a very tough decision. I need to think this through. Okay. Lazy and Vibranium are low, so I can't go to them. Slick does not have good special defense. Yeah, it's either Forehead or KFC. No, Slick, it can't really hit Slick with anything super effective though, that's the thing. Slick might actually be the better option. Let's go to Slick and Iron Head. I know it's a special attacker, but I also know it can't really hit me with anything super effective. <sighs> Alright, this is your Ace, level 56. Okay, we do, we are two levels higher. So go for Iron Head. Blizzard. Oh god, okay, it's Stab, but it's not super effective. We can take one. Come on, Slick. Mmm, we actually can't. Oh, shoot. Really? No way. I thought we could take one. What was your speed? I know you're really slow. Okay, KFC, come in here. Okay, I know you're really quick, Frostlass. Attract? Aw, oh, that's BS. Yes, we land! Okay, take it out, take it out, come on. Yes, KFC, let's go! Oh my god, dude, Steelix has been here for so long. Okay. At least the Frostlass is down. He really went for Attract. Oh my gosh. Alright, we get the speed boost. What's next? Wall Rain. Okay, I gotta switch. <sighs> okay, we need Vibranium here. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I can't, I can't stand with Forehead or KFC. I can't really do anything with Jaws and Lazy is obviously weak to this whole gym. So, um, yeah, Vibranium is probably our best bet here. Let's go ahead and use a Hybrid Potion. Aqua Ring, that's annoying. Why would you do that? Okay, go for a Thunder Punch. He goes for Surf. Okay, that doesn't do much. Okay. Hopefully you... Okay, I think that was just surf again. Hopefully you can't just you just can't do much to Registeel, and then we should be able to just oh, oh no, don't put me to sleep. Ugh, that's annoying. Well, you know what? If it's gonna put me to sleep, that's fine. I'll just have to end up waking up later. I I'll use my full heals. Thunder Punch. Okay, we're put to sleep. Let me grab. Do I have any awakenings? If not, I have full heals, so it's fine. Yeah, full heal. Bring me back. Surf, you're dumb. Um, bring this. Super pushing up. I don't want to bait the crit, that's the only thing. Um, that's why I'm healing even when I'm on half. Okay. I just want to be in the range where I can take a crit, like, at all times. Dude, I can't believe Steelix went down to just Blizzard like that. Like, that's so annoying. <sighs> okay, um, wake up. Goes for Surf. Um,. Alright, and just thunder punch it. No, you freaking stop yawning me, bruh. And I kind of have to switch. Glaceon. Okay. I think, uh, I'm, I'm confident that KFC can probably one-shot this. Double team? No way. Oh my god, it actually didn't one-shot. Okay, just, all you have to do is land. Yes! Okay, let's go, KFC. KFC the goat. 
Okay, speed boost up, Weavile. Okay, well I already know I outspeed, so as long as I land a Blaze Kick, this thing is super frail. Oh no, it has a Focus Ash. Oh, Aerial Ace! Okay, it's not Stab, it's not Stab, it's not Stab, it's not Stab, it's not Stab. Come on, it's not. Whew. Oh, and I burned it, I burned it, I burned it! Okay, so this should take it out. Yes! Let's go! Gain the experience, that was the last one. Yes, we beat Candace. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. Wow, you're great, really, really great. I think your focus and will bowled us over totally. Oh, that's right, I'm supposed to give you this. And we get ourselves the Icicle Badge of Snowpoint Gym. Let's go. Seven badges, dude. We're seven badges deep in Renegade Platinum. That Icicle Badge I just gave you? Because you have it, you can use the Hidden Move Rock Climb anytime, even when you're not in a battle. Oh, and take this too. Ooh. Get some TMs. What is this, Blizzard? Or Avalanche. No, yeah, she gives you Avalanche. Okay. Can you imagine what sort of focus you need to pull it off? Oh my gosh. All right. So against all odds, we have indeed defeated Candace. Sadly, Steelix did go down to my highest level. This dude has been here for a while. <sighs> but we do come out victorious. So let's go ahead and box our Fallen Steelix Pro. We are one death away from having a full death box. That's insane. All right, who do we want to add to the team? A lot of good choices here. Mm, I already have, I would add Chimchar because Infernape, I love Infernape, but I already have a firefighting type. So maybe I should go with Crescent and have an Ursaring. Also though, I could go with Bulbasaur. That might be a good choice. Let's hold off. Let's decide at the end of the episode what we're going to add. Um, and pot Oh, I need a heal. Potentially, we could maybe try and get some more gift Pokemon as well. So, before we do any of that, let's continue on. And now that we have Rock Climb, let's see if we can help out our boy Henry. So, Rock Climb. Let's oh, it's 100 base power in this game? Hello? Okay, maybe I can give it to Forehead. This accuracy is 90, this accuracy is 80. I could just get rid of Rock Slide and give myself Rock Climb. Stop trying to teach you for now. Who else can learn it? Okay, maybe for now, maybe for now I can hold off and I can just give it to like Steelix. Can Steelix learn it? Because then I, I, I know Steelix has fainted, but we can just use it like how we use our Articuno to fly. I'm sorry, Slick, I have to bring you back so soon. Can you learn Rock Slide? Rock Climb, and he can. Okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna just use you for Rock Climb right now. Guess get rid of Crunch, because we can no longer use you. Sad face, but it is what it is. Let's continue. Uh, I believe Barry... Sorry, not Barry. I always call him Barry, because that's his real name, but... Henry is somewhere this way. Yep, Acuity Lakefront. We already got our encounter here. I think this is where we got the Teddy Ursa. Alright, let's head up here. Yes, I'd like to use Rock Climb. Boom. Reaper Cloth. Okay, so we can involve a um, Shuppet if we get it. <laughs> I don't know that we will, but on the off chance, then we can. You're not getting away with this, Team Galactic. Oh, are you finished already? Your Pokemon aren't bad, but you're laughably weak. You honestly thought you could save the Pokemon of the lake and become the Pokemon champion? Dream on, little kid. But ew, it's so cold here. Let's go back to the Veilstone HQ. Wow, she really just roasted my boy like that. Oh, don't I know you? We met in Eterna City. Listen, Team Galactic is going to is going to do something huge for everyone's sake. That's why you should keep out of a keep out of Team Galactic's way. Don't come whining about poor Pokemon and other trivial junk like that. Don't waste your time coming to our HQ in Failstone. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay, Mrs. Rude. Yeah, that's right. I couldn't do anything against Team Galactic. The Pokemon called Uxi. It was suffering. I'm going to get tougher. It's not about winning or losing. It's not good enough. I have to be stronger. It's not enough to just want to be the most powerful trainer ever. It takes honest effort and a determined heart. Dang, so <laughs> Henry is quite literally going to go to the mountains and train. Um, wait, okay. This is Acuity Lakefront. This is Lake Acuity. So technically, I think I can get an encounter here with by fishing. If it lets me. 
Oh, it actually does. Okay, so we get an encounter right here. All right, first encounter for Lake Acuity is a... That's, that's dupes. That is dupes. Get off of my screen. <laughs> that is freaking dupes. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, no, the Pokemon got away. Come on. Not even a nibble. Bro, I hope there's not only furs here. I reeled in too quickly. Don't go to my trainer card, bro. Good run. Okay, let's go to a different part. Let's go right here. Come on. Not even a nibble. This is it from the furret. <laughs> Bro, come on. Give me an encounter. Come on. I might have to bring a surfer in case, like, there's only furrets here. Ah, oh, got away. I need to stop speeding up that part. Continues to do it anyway. Oh my god, I actually need to stop. I'm literally screwing myself over. Come on. Oh my gosh. Good run. Yes. Landed him on. And it is. Okay, it's a freaking fur. Alright, no. We need to we need to go in and grab someone that can surf. Because I'm not having this. I'm not having this at all. Yes, rock climb down here. And run this way. Bro, come on. Hey Yursa, leave me alone. <laughs> okay. Let me go to the Pokemon Center. Right? Let me get a surfer. This is a whole process, bruh. <laughs> Alright. Move you. And let me just get Articuno as well so we can fly. So, uh, I still need Steelix. Alright. Jaws, chill here for a second. Well, I know, you're still on the team. So you still, you chill right here. I don't, and the reason if you're wondering why I'm not giving my Feraligator Surf, it's a little bit obvious, but also, like, I don't, he's a physical attacker, so I don't want to give him special moves. So that's why he's, uh, He's gonna chill in the box real quick. Um, and you as well. Alright, I'm currently carrying three three fainted hold on, you switch here. I'm currently carrying three fainted mods for a very specific reason, because I need to use all three of their HM moves. And you're about to see why. So one, we're gonna use Steelix for rocks rock climb, then we're gonna use Blastoise to surf and get our encounter, and then we're gonna use Articuno to fly to Veilstone City where the headquarters are. And now we don't have to go back to Snowpoint City. <laughs> I guess this is what you get when you play Gen 4 with all, with all its HMs. Okay. Encounter, come on. Our encounter is... Ooh, Frost Slash. Okay. Honestly, that's not even that bad. But what can I attack it with? Probably nothing. Yeah, I think I literally cannot hit it with anything or it will faint. So... I might not even be able to catch it. Let's just throw some Ultra Balls. Come on. Come on, Frost Slash. Get caught. Frost Slash. Come on. Come on. Okay, I'll give it 10 more. One. Two. Wow, it actually got caught. I guess it really wanted to be caught. Frostlass, the Snowland Pokemon. Um. Alright, let's call you. Let's call you Sleet. Because that's. I mean, that's, I guess that's a form of ice. I don't know. <laughs> we'll go with it. So we got Sleet, the Frostlass. Uh, give me a T real quick. Boom. Alright, and now we've used you to rock climb, we've used you to surf. And now we're going to use you to fly. And actually, before we go to Veilstone, let's go to uh, Jubilife. Because there's actually more gift Pokemon in Jubilife that I have not gotten. Yes, you might be wondering. <laughs> didn't you already not get the starters? These <laughs> these starters from here? Yes, I did miss, them out, miss out on them. And also, there's a gift egg here that I missed out on. So I need to also grab that. So let's go ahead and do that as well. Articuno, you go right there. Um, Steelix... Your spot is right here. I can't believe my my highest level fainted. That's the same thing that happened when my Porygon Z died. It was my highest level. <sighs> Rest in peace, Steelix. Alright, well you two, you get yourselves back on the team. And, boom. Uh, Actually, wait. Yeah, I need to grab the egg. I need a free spot. So let's go down here. I think it's in the Pokemon School. I think it's in here. I think it's you. No, it's not you. Oh no, it's definitely this person. Yes. Give me the egg. Yes! Alright, we get the Pokemon egg. Nice. Alright, so I don't know how long this thing is going to take to hatch, but I guess we will do it off screen for now. Alright, here's what we'll do. Let's go ahead and pick our next team member, right? Um, ooh, actually, Frostlass might not even be a bad addition, because we don't have a special attacker. Ice Ghost is a pretty unique type. Let's actually add Frostlass. So, before we add Frostlass, uh, grab Articuno. 
all this HM techers that we have to do. <laughs> okay, go here. Egg, you sit in the box. Okay, chill right there. Now, <laughs> come outside. Articuno. See, this would be so much easier if I just had the HMs on my team, but I'm telling you guys, it's better in Renegade Platinum to have a good moveset than to clog it with HMs. The only reason I'm going to have an HM is if it actually fits my mom's moveset, which in this case, it definitely doesn't. So let's go ahead, let the let the egg sit right here, grab Frostlass, shift it onto the team, and it will take the place of Steelix, and now Articuno can finally chill back in the box until we need to fly again. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and heal up, and if you guys enjoyed this episode of the Pokemon Renegade Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke, please let me know by dropping a like below, subscribing, and yeah, it's been your boy ZLA. I'll see you guys next time, peace out.